las cosas como son, las vemos como somos. Does that make sense to you? Do you agree? Yes. Laya? That's okay, it's great. All right. We're going to see some of this now. Now, I will uh, say something else to you that is even perhaps more provocative. Everything that you see, hear, feel, smell, taste, and touch is a reflection of your own relationship with you inside you. So, in fact, I'll say it in Spanish. It comes out. <coughs> no hay nada fuera. Todo está dentro de mí. Lo que creas, lo que creas aquí, creas aquí. Y vamos a verlo hoy. Can you pass the next slide? Okay. So, little baby. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um, you were like that once. I'm just going to talk to you now about how reality gets in your head, gets created. Okay? Your bit, how reality gets created. So you were like this one. You were like this one. And you were born in a hospital or at home or in a field or somewhere. I don't know. You were born somewhere. <coughs> Who was there? And you can tell me, please say it. it's practice for English. Who was there when you were born? Our man. Sorry? Mum. Your mum. Yes, not my mum. Your mum. Yes. Your mum. Who else? Father. Your father. The nurse. The doctor. The nurse. Grandmother. Ah, you yourself. You, of course. You were there. Um, yeah. Sorry? Grandparents. Grandparents. <laughs> your brother. <laughs> you were a twin. You're a twin. Yeah, your brother. Did he come afterwards or before? <laughs> so, and then your uncles. And your friends, your, your parents' friends, who you call uncle and auntie, and people came. And what do they say? What do they say to this baby on this first day of its born? What do they say to it? Oh, oh, oh it's so beautiful, yes. And they say, oh, look, he looks just like his father. <laughs> yeah? And then suddenly the baby's half asleep and goes, goes huh. and they say, ah, he's going to play basketball. <laughs> Yeah, or, oh look, he's crying, oh, he's going to be an actor. And we start to tell the baby, he's got, oh, give me a bit of an can you get actor? And we start to label, etiquette, yeah, label the baby. We start to label them with. <laughs> Watch it. Watch it. We start to label them with. Uh, <clears throat> Things, you know, with the character of things. So they're intelligent, they're funny, they're interesting, they're dynamic, they're angry, they're bad tempered, they're naughty, they're bad, they're stupid, they're clumsy. We start to label the babies. And you know, babies are very, very intelligent creatures. So when you tell them stuff, they believe it. So gradually you adopt the things that people tell you. Now, something I don't know if you know this, you're all linguists, you're studying a language. When that baby's born, uh, the first sense that gets developed in the womb is hearing. So it's not a blank sheet. The baby's hearing stuff. However, in the first six months of the baby's life, that baby is capable, can understand, recognize, and produce any sound on earth. Any human sound on earth, that baby can produce it. So its potential is absolutely enormous. However, as the baby grows and it learns that, you know, maybe a Chinese uh, vowel with a tone doesn't work in Girona, uh, it just funnels what it learns to get the food and sleep and attention it wants. So gradually we close our senses. And what we start to adopt are programs. Programs? Programs of behavior. Programs of thought, programs of language, programs of beliefs. And those programs start to condition the way you look at the world. So, I'm going to ask you another question. This comes out in our language. Yeah, somewhere. The baby is cute. The baby, okay, that's a very interesting point, Sandra. Somebody said to me, and I'll ask you the question, thank you for that. Uh, do you know the word charisma? Yeah. Is charisma born? Or can you learn it? 
many think it's porn? No. How many people think it's porn? And how many people think charisma is learned? You can learn. And how many people don't know? <laughs> That's fine. Don't know is a good position. 